<laughs> yeah? Yeah. Hello. I was just wondering if maybe uh, I could um, bum a smoke. I thought you hated smoking. Ah, uh, yes. Well, don't tell Miranda. Jesus. I'll have to quit someday, I guess. You have worked on many well-known films, theater and television shows. So what is the difference between working in USA and here? Um, we don't have companies. Um, I started a theater company in Chicago, but of course, because we started it, we got no salary. Uh, it was just love of theater. So um, I love that this is a company. I love that they know each other. When we have a theater piece in America, everybody's a stranger, usually. Everybody's a stranger. Here, everybody knows each other. So sometimes in rehearsal, I'm just like, and they're all, ah, they're talking about stuff. And I let them do that because I know, having been in a company in Chicago, that the actors can sometimes find solutions much better than I can. Regarding the continuous reduction of culture in the public space nowadays, what will the future be like? I hope the intelligent people win. I don't know if they will. They certainly are not winning in my country right now. But I have faith that the people that we think are not intelligent are actually intelligent. And maybe they're going to wake up and go, this is not right. This is not, certainly in my country. My president is taking it way too far right now. And they're saying things that are reminding me of Germany in 1932, and I don't like that. Um, and I'm hoping that the rest of my fellow Americans are waking up as well. You are preparing the play called Not Safe for Work by Lucy Kirkwood, and you are preparing it for this edition of Ohrid Summer Festival. So what about this play inspired you? I thought this play was great for the summer. It's, it's very funny, but it's also very intelligent. It's very cutting. And I like, uh, I, I call it comedy with teeth. Um, so um, I, hope, I hope everyone enjoys it. I think, I think the cast is doing a great job. In regards to the genre farcical comedy, what are you looking for in the actors? How are they supposed to act? So it's really, it's more than just the comedy. The first act is very comedic. The second act is kind of heavy. And the third act is kind of bizarre. I think this play reminds me a lot of Sam Shepard. And in Sam Shepard, an actor has to be willing to commit to a, um, an objective. If my objective is to make you like me, but my words are, I hate you, I will always hate you, I hate you. But my subject is, I hate you, I hate you, I will always hate you. You have to commit to a subtext that's different than the language. And the actors have been very responsive to that, and we're having a very good time.